Hey guys, it's Joe, and today I'll be showing you some of my Gamerverse um, Marvel Avengers figures and one of my pop figures that um, I recently got a couple months ago. So before we get started, don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed the content and uh, check out more videos. Um, today, also, I just want to say that uh, I've been uploading a lot more Marvel today because um, I actually haven't uploaded Marvel a lot. Just maybe the episodes, like I've said in my past videos. Um, but uh, I'm doing some more Marvel, and I'll still do my other things as well. Um, I also have that card box still from yesterday. Uh, so let's get started. So first we have this pop figure. It is the Thanos comic version, the 80 years of Marvel. And I really like this pop because it actually shows the first appearance of him in the comics. And it was the Invincible Iron Man um, from this. So that is really cool. Yeah, because he's one of Iron Man's uh, villains. The first appearance, the Invincible Iron Man number 53, if you can see on the side. But yeah, this figure is pretty cool. This figure is pretty cool, but he doesn't actually have the stones on the fist, which is like, okay, it's okay, though. But let's move on to the game reverse, guys. Uh, they're in this uh, thing right here. So our first figure, we have the Abomination from uh, the uh, game. I actually really like this fight scene with him and Hawk in it. It's actually one of my favorites um, in the whole, like, story campaign mode. Uh, pretty good game. Not many people liked it, but I really liked the uh, story mode, and uh, hopefully we can get a second one, maybe just make a couple, uh, just do some changes and stuff, maybe. I uh, am maybe to the uh, multiplayer as well. Uh, next, we have the uh, uh, Iron Man suit. Uh, I actually have another one of these. But this one is one of my favorites, basically the regular Iron Man suit. He was kind of weird in the game, I do feel like, though. Didn't feel like your average Tony Stark, because I think when we first met him, he was like on the side of a can, a Grand Canyon kind of thing or something like that, but uh, like mountain rocks or something. So, um, yeah, this is one of my uh, cool figures as well. And they do have accessories in here, but I'm not going to show those. Next we have, I forgot the suits and names of these, but then we also have this one. Uh, this is actually one of my first ones I got from the Game Reverse series. Pretty cool. Um... Next, we have our only store in here as well. Um, this one, actually, they made a new version of this I've seen before. He actually has the helmet piece on it, not a huge change. But, uh, yeah, this is just, uh, this is actually one of my favorites. Uh, not character-wise in the MCU, but one of my favorite figures I do have from here. Uh, next, we have one of the Hulk uh, suits. Uh, this one is, um, I guess, like a jungle kind of one. Um, Hulk, I didn't like Hulk in this game as playable as well, so, yeah, he also has one of those, like, attack kind of fist power things, whatever they're called. Um, next we have one of our Captain Americas, this is probably the best one, uh, so far, I think, with, this is an amazing shield you can pop off and put on the back. So, pretty cool figure, right there. Uh, so yeah, and then I'm just gonna get this one out of the way, but it's really big. It's a huge Venom one. It's not part of the game reverse, but I did have it in here, so it's so pretty cool. Um, uh, we have actually I'll just put these two right away. Uh, two different Miss Marvels. They came in different sets. Actually, uh, no, not you can't really see it, but she has the fist part, and then this one I. I don't know what the difference really is. Uh, back on the pants, I guess, the stripes and stuff. But I, it doesn't matter. But, uh, yeah, that's the Miss Marvel figures. Uh, and then we also have this. You can actually... Um, it actually came with... Um, so these, I think, you can, like, take apart or something like that. Because uh, you actually have to buy multiple different ones to build him up. This And it's like a bigger abomination from the other version. Uh, which is right here. Look at that. Um, I think it's like a bigger version of him. But like you have to like buy like different ones. I think you have to buy like the leader. Uh, that Marvel guy. The Captain America. One of the Iron Mans. And uh, Miss Marvel. For the arms. Yeah and here. Here's one of the legs. Let me see if this actually goes in. Let's see, okay, this goes in. I don't think so. I think, yeah, yeah, I think you need one more piece for that. It's not fitting in right now, but it probably does. Uh, then we have this Iron Man suit. Um, here's actually some of the black suits you can put on the bottom. Uh, 
Uh, so yeah, this is a pretty cool one. It's probably one of my, uh, my second favorite suit from this uh, one, from the uh, figures. So they're coming out with many other more uh, from for these I've seen, but uh, then we have our last Captain America. This one's pretty good. This one's all right. I the red in the front is okay. Uh, I think it comes with a shield. Let me take a look at the gun as well. Same shield. Uh, you can just pop on the back. Just pop that on the back. So, yeah, this is pretty cool. I do like this one. Uh, let's see. And then we have the villain. I mean, like, not really the villain. I don't know if they made a, um, a MODOK one, though. Um, you can just put in here. And put a shield in the front for, ta for Taskmaster. He was not even really involved in the game at all. I mean, like, what? Just in front of, in the beginning. Um, that was it. We didn't, yeah, that was it. So, yeah, this was, like, I wish we would have had more of him, because that would have been cool. I'm, like, we get to know the character more, because he is going to be in the next Black Widow movie. And then, there's some accessories in here. And then, for our last one, we have the space iron man suit this one is probably one of the best nice back part to it uh this is a nice suit uh in the game as well uh really i recommend this game like for the story mode campaign pretty much if you haven't gotten it yet the multiplayer all right uh, just not really as good as the campaign is, as you know, I'm mean, like some of the multiplayer for games are good, like Call of Duty and stuff. So, but yeah, this is uh, this is a good figure. So, which one was your favorite figure from this? And I definitely recommend checking out the game and buying it. Uh, bye, guys.